great to have you. We're back, XT Fitness, 5.30 a.m. class live, download on YouTube anytime you want. Hey, Stephen Covey, who, what did, what did Stephen Covey write? The seven habits of highly successful people. One of his habits, I, I don't know if it was a habit, but he talked about filling up your emotional bank account, okay? I don't know about you, but I've been, I have to admit, I'm usually pretty even keel on my emotions, but I've been like this uh, the last few days. And everywhere from, yes, we can do this, it's gonna pass, to holy shit, we're freaking dying. So, um, fill up somebody's emotional bank account today, okay? Deposit something in their emotional bank account. Um, make them feel good. Help them out uh, some way or another. Those are my thoughts for the day. I won't bore you with all my, my philosophical views. Anyhow, here's what we have today. Okay, so listen to this. So listen to this. You can either do, there's nine minute increments today. We're gonna go 27 minutes today. You can either do a nine minute workout during the day. If you just wanna knock out nine minutes of this, it's going to be beneficial. Start warming up as I'm talking. Get some arm circles, get some high knees in, get some hinges. So warm up as I'm talking, because we're gonna get right into it, okay? Um, you can do 18 minutes, just do it again. You can do 27 minutes. You can do 36 minutes, I wouldn't. 27 minutes is fine of this full body, functional workout, okay? Uh, I know that if you're live right now, you're not able to see the, the, the signs, and maybe you can't even see them anyhow. Um, oh shoot, I said can't again. Knock the T off the foot, the can't. Put an I in front of it, what do you have? I can't. Anyhow, um, I, I, the GoPro YouTube video, I think you'll be able to see him. Someone suggested that, and I thought that was a great idea. Uh, so anyhow, with that said, three minutes, three minutes, three minutes. We're gonna start with dumbbell or kettlebell. Floor to mill. Now, if you have a kettlebell, and you're not comfortable flipping it, flipping it at the top there, you see how I flipped it? You can do two hands, two hand kettlebell. If you have a dumbbell, boom, boom. I've designed these workouts that you have a kettlebell. I'm assuming you have a kettlebell or a dumbbell or you don't have anything. And believe me, you do this workout with your fist and it's going to be beneficial throughout the day. Eight dumbbell kettlebell floor to mill. You have three minutes to do it. Eight plank push rows. So we did a plank row yesterday. Today we're going to do a full push up row. That's one. Okay, full push up. Stay with that same side. Two. Because we're going to do this two times in that three minutes. And then you have four burpees. Then you have four burpees. Okay, times two. Three minutes to do it. If you finish, 20 runners. 20 runners, one, two, three, 20, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees. And then you revisit this if you have time in that three minutes. So we're gonna go through that twice, get that, revisit. Again, I'm gonna keep talking about this too. Eight dumbbell Florida mill, eight plank push, but you, you get, you get it. My members, my members know exactly what I I'm talking about. They hang on to every word I say. Now, for those of you that are just watching, uh, again, I will keep going over it and direct your path. Right here, eight switch squat jumps. Check it out. Here, switch. Can you see that kettlebell? I'm switching, staying low. Eight switch, switch, switch squat jumps. Uh, eight kettlebell. The or dumbbell, forward lunge for eight, alt lunge, okay? Four MBMs. Let's talk about the MBM for those of you who don't know. A Mike Brady or a Mike Brady with Marsha. It's a long story, I'm not gonna go into it. Uh, message me if you wanna hear the history of the MBM. But a, a Mike Brady with Marsha is a hinge, a full squat, a burpee and a lunge, that's one Mike Brady. Hinge, full squat, burpee, boom. With that said, switch squat jumps, switch squat jumps for eight, kettlebell front lunge for eight, four Mike Brady's. And I'll show you modifications for all this, for all this when we're doing the workout. Hopefully you can hear me. Give me feedback. 
RHB, a Royal H burpee. An RHB is no push up, no jump, no clap. Eight squiles, squat, heil, heil. So the last three minutes times two is all body weight. Inchworm, check it out. As far as you can go out, clap your hands up. Four of those. Now, look at this. If you have a pull-up bar at home, if you have a pull-up bar, instead of the four inchworms, do six pull-ups, okay? Again, three stations, three minutes of each one. You have to get through it twice. If you get through it twice, you do 20 runners, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees, okay? And uh, we'll do that three times. If you do it once, because you only have nine minutes today, uh, that's fine. You're gonna be benefit. It's gonna benefit you. It's gonna benefit you. Okay, so I think I'm on time here. I, I want to explain the work. I feel like I didn't explain the workout as, as well uh, during my 5:30 class. Usually, which there's people tuning in. You're getting get, get ready to roll. Get ready to roll. Uh, I explain the workout. I give a funny mon monologue uh, again, where people just grasp onto every word I say. I'm not going to do that today. Okay, we're going to get right into this workout. So get ready in about 20 seconds for the dumbbell or kettlebell floor to mill for eight. And I'm going to keep instructing you. I'm going to keep encouraging you. I'm going to motivate you. And I hope I make you laugh sometimes. Ready? We are up. Hope you're good and warmed up. Hope you're good and warmed up. Got a little, you got your heart just pumping a little bit. Okay, up and 10, up and 10. Six, five, four, three, two, one, let's go. So eight dumbbell floor to mill, eight dumbbell. In fact, I'm going to put, so you can see this. And you know what, you're, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. After the eight dumbbell floor to mill, Plank push poles. You do a push, a pole, you do a full push up. There's one. Pole, full push up. I'll start demonstrating this. And then four burpees. You got it. You got it. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do some of this with you. I'm gonna do a little bit of this with you. But actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually get my own workout in of this exact workout right after this. Let's go. See if you get it twice. Check out some form. I'll just demonstrate some form if you need some help with the technique. If you're not comfortable flipping a kettlebell here with one hand, then pull it up with two and take a full range of motion. Get it up there. If you have a dumbbell, I should have brought a dumbbell here. Again, just up, keep it close to the body. So the dumbbell is pulled close to the body, close to the body, all the way up and down, pulled close to the body. Throw the hips into it and flip that dumbbell and get that full range of motion, okay? now. And then four burps, and then four burpees. Thanks, Royal H burpee. Uh, do that twice, okay? You have 90 more seconds. To get that in twice, I'm gonna bring the board up. I'm gonna bring the board up. To get that in twice, it's probably backwards on my, uh, on my live feed, but it won't be on the YouTube station, okay? See that? Eight dumbbell, floor to mill, eight plank, Push poles, that means you do a push up and you pull. I'm gonna do one side, and then the second time I'm gonna just do it one side. You can go four and four, but after you finish this twice, 20 runners, 20 runners, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees. Okay? I'm gonna be able to do a couple, maybe nine minutes, a couple of nine, maybe one nine minute segment with you uh, once we get this rolling. Hey, you have 48 seconds, you have 48 seconds. Um, I'm not, again, I'm not sure where you're at right now. You might be at the 20 runners, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees. You might be uh, wondering how to do a pull push. And remember, it's, it's a push up position, core tight. Eyes over the fingertips. Get those eyes over the fingertips. Keep that, don't get that butt down. Keep a, a strong core. Really, if you want to make it really hard, bring your feet together, squeeze your butt together, and pull, full push up. There's one. Pull. Full push-up, there's two. You can just use your arm. You have 12 seconds, 12 seconds. You can just use your arm, then you get a 25 second break. 
Just take some. Just take, yeah, yeah. Again, thanks for being here. Thanks for being here. Time! Okay, okay, you ready? Eight, switch, switch, squat, jumps. Eight, switch, squat, jumps. Eight, lunge, all lunges, and then four mic breaks. We're up in four. You can rest if you need it. Three, two, one. Eight, switch, squat. God, that's tough to say. I'm unable at this time to say it. I don't want to say I can't say switch, squat, jumps. I'm unable at this time, but with a lot of work, patience, perseverance, I know eventually I'll be able to say that better. See, I didn't say can't. You hear that? Anyhow, get them in. Let's go. You're working. Eight kettlebell dumbbell front lunges. Again, four each way. If you don't have a kettlebell, hey, that's fine. Just do forward off lunges with your hands right here. Look what I have. A gallon of bleach. That's eight pounds. Do it with your gallon of bleach. Remember, Mike Brady's with Marsha. It's a hinge. It's a squat. It's a burp. And it's one lunge. There's one. Just demonstrate some form and technique on those MBMs. Hopefully, you were watching. If you don't, or you're, uh, or you're not able, or it's very taxing to get the full push up with the MBM, just do a Mike Brady, which is a hinge. It's a full squat, okay? Nope, it's an RHB basically. Mike Brady with Marsha. Once you do those, once you do that twice, once you do that twice, what do you have? You have 20 runners, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees. Gosh, that'd be great if everybody at the end of this filled my emotional bank account with some uplift. Okay? Anyhow, keep, keep going, keep working. Keep working because you have a minute 15. You have a minute 15. And I'm going to keep repeating these exercises. Eight switch squat jumps. Eight switch squat jumps here. Back straight, hips back, chest up. Switch. Okay, push, dumbbell push, plank row, eyes over fingertips, full push, abs tight, pull, full push, abs tight, glutes together, gluteus maximus together, pull, and of course the MBMs. You have 40 seconds by the way, the hinge, the squat, the burpee, and the lunge. Thanks, Royal H. Burpee in 1939 for creating the Royal H. Burpee and as it evolved over the years. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. We'll, we'll keep your name alive. Thanks for strengthening hearts. That 13 seconds. 13 seconds. Let me, I'm going to finish that here in a second, but that, that rant, uh, or not, not rant, that uplift about Royal H. Burpee. Four, three, uh, two, one. Okay, you don't need a body. Hey, if you have a if you have a pull up a bar, pull up rack, rings hanging from the ceiling, I'll show you that. Get ready for it. You're up in 15 seconds. Eight RHBs, eight squiles, which is a squat high Ohio, four inchworms or six pull ups, times two, and then you go 20 runners, 20 X TGX, 20 high knees. You ready to go? Ready for RHBs? Eight of them. Go. Let's go. Eight RHBs. Remember, an RHB, an RHB. Stand up all the way, glutes together. Jump it up to the full flat foot if you're able. Squiles, squat, heil, heil. Squat, heil, heil. Heil is a high impact alt lunge. If you don't want to have any impact here, squat, reverse lunge. Reverse lunge, squat, reverse lunge, reverse lunge, squat, inchworm. Again, hopefully you're just watching me. Some of you might just be watching for the entertainment factor and not even doing anything. I hope that's not you. Uh, inchworm, core tight. As far, if, if this is all far that you can go without those hips, as soon as those hips break, as soon as those hips break, you're not there yet. Stop there. 
hey, draw a chalk line and see if you can go out farther the next time you do it. Keep the core tight, suck it in, suck the belly button a little bit, that back towards the spine, keep that natural curve in your lower lumbar, lower back. Remember, you have a minute and 40 seconds left to do eight RHBs, eight squiles, four inchworms, okay? Then you go do 20 runners, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees. One time, if there's still time on the clock, Revisit the RHBs. God. Royal H. Burpee. Thank you. The descendants of Royal H. Burpee. Thank you. Thank you for strengthening bone over the years. Thank you for giving us an exercise to build lean muscle. Thank you for giving us a full body functional exercise that gets your heart rate up. Therefore, you have to expand your lungs. Therefore, the blood and the uh, pumps through the veins and the art back through the or through the, the the arteries back up through the veins and thick it widens those out those carotid arteries that get blood flow to the brain that give you that exercise high. So thank you, Royal H Burpee. We can do that anywhere on this planet, the Burpee, and get a great workout in. That's my little dedication to Royal H Burpee. 28 seconds. 28 seconds left. Eight RHB, eight squiles, eight inchworms. Remember, squiles are squat, high Ohio. Do you get? Do you understand why I call them squiles? Do you get it? We do a squat in Ohio, so I call. Okay, I can tell nobody really laughed, and they're tired of that. Ten seconds. Six, five, four, three, two. You only have twenty-five seconds. Now remember, if you're new to this, this is going to kick your butt. If this is your first workout. Good luck walking for the next three to four days, unless you pace it out. We're going back to dumbbell or kettlebell, floor to mill, eight plank push ups, four burpees. You ready to go? Yeah, you can rest more if you need it. Rest more if you need it. Ready, go. Three minutes are on the clock. Let's go. Dumbbell or kettlebell, floor to mill. I'll demonstrate the exercises as we go here. You have a kettlebell and you're comfortable flipping it. Core tight here, back straight, squat through the heels. As you power up, pull, pop those hips all the way, one movement. You don't want here and then a push. It's all one. I love it. Functional fitness, everybody. Plank, push, pulls, plank, push, pulls. Remember, it's a full push. Keeping the core tight. Don't drop those hips. Eyes over the fingertips. Pull. Push. Pull. That's number two. That's how you count those. Four burpees. Four burpees. Okay. As you remember, as you're doing the exercises, there's the board. Hopefully you can see it. As you're doing the exercises, think of me as back or as elevator music. Okay? I'm going to keep talking. Sometimes when you get into an elevator and it's quiet, it, it's, it's just kind of uncomfortable and there's other people in there. But when the elevator music comes on and you're kind of listening to that song that you recognize, but it's, it's nice, isn't it? I'm elevator music a lot to my class. You know, I talk a lot throughout the workout. Some people grasp onto the words, but some people like, I'm glad he keeps talking. I'm glad. Okay? I know, you know, again, I, hey, everybody, let's go. 90 seconds. 90 seconds. Dumbbell or kettlebell, four to mill, eight plank push pulls, four burpees. I'm going to do a round. I'm going to do it. Remember, if you have a kettlebell and you're not comfortable, use two hands, but make sure you don't stop here. Take it all the way up and back. You should lock your thumbs into that kettlebell like that. Take it up and back. If you have a dumbbell, if you have a gallon of milk, you know what? That eight pounds will add a little bit. It'll get your heart rate up. What are we here for today? You know what I, you know why I work out? Oh, hey, hey, we'll talk. Uh, and burps, you have the burps. Plank push pulls and four burpees. If you're able, try not to touch those thighs on the floor, on the burpee, okay? If your floor is dirty, you touch your thighs, you get dirt right here. 30 seconds, by the way, and your clothes get a little dirty. Here at XT Fitness, you don't get that. 
the floors are spotless and sterilized here at XT Fitness. Anyhow, 19 seconds, 19 seconds. We're in our second round. We're doing these three boards three times. And if you finish those two rounds, you do the 20 runners, 20 XT jacks, four, three, two, one. Awesome. High five. Oh, that was dumb. I just do that. You know, I'm trying to be original. Uh, 18 seconds. 18 seconds. We, where are we at? Where are we at? We're on the eight switch squat jumps, eight kettlebell or dumbbell front lunge. Mike Brady's with Marsha. Are you ready to go? I'm going to put that there. Maybe you can see that better. Maybe that's the best, me best method. Ready? Switch squat jumps here. Switch it up. Look at this. Shoulder blades back here. You're squatting, chins up. You should never be looking down. Be arm back here. Don't, get, 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 get the arm off the thigh. Get the arm off the thigh. You put the arm off the thigh, put training wheels on your bike this spring too. Make that easier. Anyhow, uh, kettlebell front squat lunge. If you're there, shoulder blades back. Don't let the chin, don't let the shoulders hang over the kneecap. Stay through that front heel on that lunge. And then Mike Brady's with Marsha. I'm not sure if you're there yet or not, but remember a Mike Brady with Marsha is a hinge. Keep the back, back straight. It's a full squat burpee lunge. Gosh. Is it me? Seriously, is it me? Or is this freaking workout awesome? I, I'm serious, because I, can't wait to do it. I'm gonna be honest with you. Two rounds of this, two rounds of this, okay? And uh, then work on 20 runners, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees. Share this today, share this today. Every, this is gonna be, this is gonna be my, this is my emotional deposit to your emotional bank account. That if it's anything like mine, the last few days, it's depleted. It's running at a deficit, okay? This is my deposit to your emotional. Yeah, sure, it's physical right now, a lot physical, but when you have that exercise high afterwards, you might look at the world a little differently, a little more optimistic. Give the world your optimism, and the, optimism, uh, the world's gonna give that optimistic, hopeful, cheerful, confident attitude right back at you. Wow, I almost teared up there. Middle left, middle left. So you have the Eight switch stop, squat. Say it three times really fast. I dare you. Switch squat jumps. Switch squat jumps. Switch squat jumps. Switch squat jumps. Why am I struggling with that? Um, eight kettlebell dumbbell front lunge. Four MBMs. Four MBMs. 36 seconds to do it. If you finished it already, again. I like to do a workout before I teach it, so just to see where how it flows. I'm doing this after. Maybe I should, should do it before. But um, not like I'm waking up at 5.20 and creating this thing in eight minutes. I'm thinking about it, okay, peeps? Peeps, I, I'm sorry I called you peeps. I don't like when I do that. 12 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. 25 second break, body weight, eight RHBs, eight squiles, four inchworms. If you have a pull up bar, if you have some rings hanging from your ceiling, you can do pull ups from that. Um, eight seconds, you ready? Eight seconds, eight RHBs, remember, remember, no squat, no push up, no clap. Check it out, let's go, eight of them, three minutes. Eight RHBs, yeah. Eight squiles, four inchworms, or six pull-ups. Uh, keep working out hard, keep working out hard. Um, you do that twice, remember, and then you go back to the 20 runners, 20, 20, runners, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees. Um, yeah, people, thanks for being here. Thanks for taking the initiative to better yourselves with physical exercise. Hopefully, people that haven't been physically exercising hop on board here. 
even if you just do nine minutes and you're done, watch the rest of it. That's fine. Do nine minutes. Do 18 minutes. We're gonna, in two minutes, we'll be done with our uh, uh, second round. And again, I'm talking to people that aren't in my class and are in my class, trying to get those two groups of people. And uh, we're diverse here at XD Fitness. Um, if you're new to this, I do a nine minutes and that's it the first day, nine minutes the second day, 18 minutes. And, you know, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to keep them at 27 minutes max. Again, freaky people like Eric Stearns can do, do it for three hours and just keep repeating this stuff. Uh, but you know what this is gonna do for you? You have 90 seconds, by the way. You have 90 seconds, by the way. I'm sure you all know uh, at this point what an RHB is, a squile and an inchworms, okay? And again, if you finish it, Get your 20 runners in, your 20 XT jacks and 20 high knees, all right? The reason why I exercise regularly, a few different reasons. It's great for my internal organs. When you sweat, when you break a sweat every day, it's like taking a shower from the inside out. It is awesome for your heart and lungs, you know this. It strengthens, thickens your bones. It gives you more better lean muscle. It gets blood flow into your joints. It helps with arthritic disease. It gets blood flow, a fresh supply to your brain, which cuts your dementia uh, chances. Uh, I think down by 50%, don't quote me on that. Um, I do it for that. I do it alone for the self-confidence and the optimism and the exercise high. Just, I mean, just that feeling of having that confident, uh, strong body. I do it for that. You know why else I do it? To look good. Gosh, dang it! That's that egotistical point of me, but you know what? You look good, you feel good, okay? I don't do tanning beds anymore. That was back in 94, 93. Eight seconds, eight seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, there's your 18 minutes. We're going one more round, one more round. It should hurt right now. Again, I'm doing this workout right after I, I, I'm done with you. So in 15 seconds, we are back to eight dumbbell, kettlebell, floor, floor to mill, floor to mill. Uh, eight plank push pulls, four burpees. I should have numbered them. I hope I've got them in the right order. Ready? You're on. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Eight dumbbell, kettlebell, floor to mill. Eight plank push poles, eight plank push poles, and four burpees, four burpees. Okay, let's talk music. Let's let's talk music. Um, by the way, you have two and a half more minutes, so you're early into this. Hopefully, I'm talking loud enough where you can turn me up a little bit and hear me, but play some nice music in the background, some of your favorite motivational music. I looked at some music today. I ah, it just was like royalty-free stuff that kind of sucked. I was gonna play it lightly in the background, but we're not gonna do that. You're gonna to listen to your own stuff. Some people don't like to listen to music at all. The important part is, is that you do at least nine minutes of this. You ready for this? Every day, every day. Yeah, you heard me, every day. The body's meant to move. Do this every day. Okay, hope you're kicking it. I hope you're rocking it. I hope you get those eight dumbbell floor mills in, those plank push poles. Remember, hey, you don't have to have a dumbbell or a kettlebell. Just do a push and pull arm, throwing that shoulder blade back, keeping that core tight, okay? Bam, I, I, I would do one side the first time for eight, and then do the other side the next round. It doesn't take a lot. Remember, I designed these workouts around seven movements. Push, pull, squat, lunge, bend, twist. Okay, that's how basically the body moves. Thanks, Paul, check. I learned that from you. Uh, he probably didn't say it first, but uh, a run a walk is the seventh one. So go for a power, power walk after this. 48 seconds. People that say, yeah, I work out, I walk. No, no. 
you do this and then you walk, okay? Nothing wrong with walking. I did it yesterday, I did a power walk, but it's nothing like bending, pushing, pulling, squatting, lunging, twisting, okay? 30 seconds. Is it me or am I just killing this workout instructional portion of this? Is it me or am I just killing this thing today with the instruction and the motivation? 19 seconds. Keep it up, keep it up. What does keep it up mean? Why did I say that? Uh, eight switch, <laughs> eight switch squat jumps, stop. 25 second break. Eight kettlebell or dumbbell front lunges. Four Mike Brady's with Marsha. That's a whole different story. Mike Brady's with Marsha. Is that too loud when I clap into the camera? I don't want to annoy you. Okay, ready? Eight switch squat jumps. Let's go. Any athlete, young athlete, can do this workout and benefit greatly, okay? If you're a young athlete and you're working out on a machine that's bolted to the floor on a fixed axis, why are you doing that? If you're a human that bends, squats, lunges, pushes, pulls, twists, and you're on a machine on this bolt of the floor on a fixed axis, and it's taking away your planes of movement, it's limiting them to one, you're working three planes of movement here, people. You don't need those machines. You know what you need? You need motivation. You need a professional trainer. You need the Tiger Woods of fitness. I'm the Tiger Woods of fitness. I gave myself that name. Anyhow, two minutes, two minutes of H, eight, eight, okay, yeah. Okay, we're at minute. We're almost finished. You're so, hopefully you're seeing the light. You know what? You have a mile left in a uh, cross country meet, okay? Don't let up now. This is when you dig in. This is when you find it deep inside to pick it up a notch, okay? You with me? Now, if you stay with me for a couple weeks here, you're gonna notice uh, what I'm saying now. I say the same thing every time, and you're gonna be like, oh God. It's kind of like P90X. It was great the first six weeks, but Tony Horton, just, just, just stop. Hopefully I'm not like that. And by the way, Tony Horton, thanks bro. Inspiration to me. Uh, minute 15 left. He was the guy, you know, P90X be like, okay, he's up. Um, four MBMs. Wait a minute, no, we're not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Four MBMs. We'll go to the body weight. We'll go to the body weight uh, in a minute. How'd you like that quiet time? It sucked, didn't it? You'd rather have me talking. Anyhow, let's go. We have 39 seconds, 39 seconds. Come on, you can do it, you can do it. And then we have one more round of three minutes. That's 20, the whole workout took about approximately 30 minutes. That's 30 minutes of getting your heart rate up there, building lean muscle, strengthening your bone, expanding your lungs, getting that exercise high. And 15 seconds, and remember this, the exercise high is the only way to fly. Gosh, let me say that again, I made it up. The exercise high is the only way to fly. Why didn't somebody tell me that in college? Three, two, one. 25 seconds, 25 seconds. Let's go, let's go. RHB. RHB, Royal H Burpee, thank you, sir. Eight squats, squat, squat, pile. High, so it's a squat high, high, inchworm or pull ups. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Come on, come on, RHBs, knock them out. Again, I'm gonna shut this off, I'm gonna upload this to Facebook, save it, and I'm gonna do this same exact workout with probably listening to probably 80s music. I'm one of those people, yeah. I, I'm struggling to get out of this late 70s, 80s, 
when Nirvana hit, yeah, I liked them, but then I stopped. Dang it, why'd I do that? I could be listening to grunge. Okay, okay, getting it. Way to rock it out, peeps. God, I said peeps again. Let's go. Last two minutes. Last two minutes. Dig down deep inside. Let's do this thing. Come on, come on. Um, share this with your friends. Do it. You can save it. Uh, it's gonna be on my Facebook page. It's gonna be on YouTube, which I have two cameras, by the way. And one is a GoPro, which I think comes out a little better and maybe the, the volume is a little better. So if you're not doing it now, go to Jim Stefan, YouTube, subscribe to my station, and uh, do the workouts there. And I have a lot of motivational two-minute videos on that station, too, that you can just click on uh, and see me. Kevin Early. What's up, my man? 90 seconds. 90 seconds. ARH. Remember, I don't want to... When you finish two rounds of all this stuff we've been doing, you do 20 runners, 20 XT jacks, 20 high knees. I'm gonna do five of each. So I'm gonna do six of each, so 20 runners. XT jacks, make them big. High knees. This isn't a high knee, this is a low knee. This, above parallel, is a high knee. 57 seconds. 57 seconds. Let's do this. Let's do this. Yeah, I do have the same shorts I had on yesterday because again, when I taught this uh, workout, I really didn't sweat. And then I worked out later in the day with different I don't have to explain that to you. Why am I explaining that to you? I do have a different shirt on though. Come on, 36 seconds. Comment below. Let me know how you like it, if you're actually doing it. Um, again, we, let's face it, we have maybe a little extra time. Some of you have some extra time on your hands. Why not start that exercise lifestyle, okay? 20 seconds, 20 seconds. Keep rocking it out. Uh, maybe you're at the 20 runners, the XT jacks, the high knees. Maybe you're still not, maybe you're already back to eight RHBs, eight squiles, four inch worms. Again, if you have a pull-up bar, knock some pull-ups out. Five, four, three, two, dos, or uno. That's it. Great job. That Uno is for you, Ruben Rodriguez. Okay. Anyhow, thanks a lot. Hope you had a good workout. See you tomorrow morning, 5.30 a.m. sharp. Watch the YouTube video. Go to YouTube. Share the YouTube video. Share this on Facebook. Everybody needs to do this, especially at a time like this. Okay? Thanks a lot. Bye.